Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gerard. Today I brought along my beautiful FX Dreamline GRS and it's rigged up to shoot some 18 grain pellets for a change. Unfortunately, the weatherman got the forecast completely wrong today because the wind is howling and it's going to make it impossible to shoot with the pellets within this wind. But as you know, I am dedicated so I'm going to find some shelter spots and still do some shooting with this gun with some pellets today. And I've got a backup slug gun in the truck if things do get rough. So let's go out there and let's get started. During the course of the day the wind was so bad that I had to take shelter with inside my truck but hey I made it work yet again and I got some more birds down. <laughs> That's a nice shot. Yes. Now while I was shooting the birds, I saw two Egyptian geese not far away and this was definitely not a task for a pellet gun. So I grabbed my slug gun and it was all systems go. Oh, that was a nice shot, straight down. Hey, there's another one there. Come on. Oh, shit. Stand still. Oh. Oh, damn. <laughs> Two Egyptian geese down. I don't think, no. Camera was not on for the second one. Damn. There we go, just shot this beautiful two Egyptian geese. Beautiful looking birds. Very, 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 very healthy. Nice and fat as well. They are gonna cook up very nicely tonight. And uh, the impact did his job. Very happy with both of those shots. From here on on, I decided to alternate between my pellet gun and my slug gun. The slug gun just makes it a little bit easier shooting in high winds like this, but once the wind dies down enough, I will take out the pellet gun again. Alright, so let's speak about the FX Dreamline GRS here quickly. Today I am shooting the Barracuda 18 grainers at 900 feet per second through this gun. 
the way that I've tuned it, I've got my regulator set at 115 bar. I've got my transfer port fully open at 25 and 30. I've got my hammer spring adjusted just enough to push this pellet out at 900 feet per second. In the front, I've got a Donny FL Tanto silencer. On top, I've got an Element Helix scope, a 6224 by 50. This kind of gun setup is perfect for hunting at short range or within the farmyard like this today. It is not a high powered gun and the pellets does not travel as far as what the slugs do. Most of the doves on this farm is very very healthy and in good condition. So I've rounded up a few for myself and this is going to go back home and straight into the freezer. Perfect. Well now I have to speak about my backup gun I suppose, it's a FX Impact M3 shooting 34 grain h and heavy slugs at 980 feet per second, Donny FL Ronin and silencer in the front, Sabre Tactical Mini Arca Rail underneath, grey form rifle stock laminate grip here as well and then on top I've got a Nightfall scope, yeah I can see that thunderstorm is rolling on very quickly now this way. Smoke them. With the sun fading into the clouds and the rain coming down, I know my day was coming to an end. But I managed to shoot another couple of pigeons before I call it a day. Well, the rain is starting to come down now and it's time for me to pack up. I didn't even think that I will be able to do some shots today. It was super crazy out there, but I did it. I want to thank you guys today for watching today's video. If you liked it, please remember to smash that like button down below. And for all the new guys, if you want to see more of this kind of content, 
please remember to subscribe because it will help me out a lot. Thanks again for watching and I will see you guys next time. Cheers. Woo.